Uh, Uni Perusera was a person of his times. He was a man uh, who had to work within a strong colonial system. The missionary ideal of the church was salvation outside of the church did not exist. And so the, the friars and other missionaries, Augustinians, Jesuits, felt this compulsion. They needed to share the good news. This was the theology of the church at the time. So I think in a, in a sense they were trying to respond the, in a spiritual way, in a practical way, to the, the, the church's own conception of itself and, and its response to the mandate of, of Christ to go and preach to all the nations, as we hear at the end of Matthew's Gospel. I would hope that the canonization will be an opportunity for us to reflect deeply on what it truly means to evangelize. What does it mean to respect the dignity of people, to respect their traditions, to respect their cultures, to respect their religious thinking, and for us to enter into dialogue with people at that level? And by the way, this has been going on. This revision has been going on really since the Second Vatican Council. There's been tremendous effort made to, to enter into a new spirit of missionary activity that does respect cultures, that does try to take into account the religious genius of people. We need to make sure that this canonization is not simply a, a chance to, to validate maybe some bad things that happen, but to challenge us always to, be, to enter into a process of reform, of conversion, and of authentic dialogue with cultures, with peoples everywhere. If that's the case, if, if the canonization can become an instrument, a tool for helping us become better Christians, better human beings, more respectful of, of everyone, and recognizing the beauty that God has created in all of its diversity, human cultures, human languages, human expressions, human ide even ideas about God that are different, but not necessarily alien or, or in say uh, that they cannot be brought together in some way or another, then I think the canonization itself will be a blessing. Mm -hmm.